Welcome back everybody to another video. This is Gaming with Kirby. The channel used to be CD House Gaming. Um, I changed the channel to my nickname Kirby that was given to me by friends. So um, sounds better than CD House Gaming honestly, let's just be honest. Uh, a lot of people don't know how to spell me house either. But anyways, we are here in uh, the 5M server of OSRP, which the uniform here is based off of Connecticut State Police. We are with San Andreas State Police Sergeant Cody Meehouse today with the CVE Unmarked um, Explorer. So right here, as you can see, it looks really nice. And this is the inside of it for you guys. Definitely based off of real life police vehicles with wheel and lights. We are inside of the city of Sandy Shores for right now, so let's go patrol around real quick and see what we can get into. And that's something you don't see every day either. Uh, Alright then. I assume that Trevor kidnapped Santa Claus. Well, if that's the case, so we will catch him and bring him to justice. Put on a seatbelt. Seatbelt is connected. All right. Hey, do there. Jeez. Tell you what. Look both ways before you cross the street, people. All right. One of my favorite spots to sit. We're actually going to go right over here to the traffic lights here in Sandy Shores, and we're going to run some light enforcement. And we'll just come right over here. Turn around, face the other way, and see if we can get anybody running the traffic lights today. And then we'll go out to the highway and run some enforcement on the 13. See what we can get for speeders. Sometimes there are some good speeders out that come through. All right. The nice part about our radars, which I will demonstrate to you guys. Next chance I have, the radars are based off of the realistic um, police radars that officers have. So, the next car I get, when you lock a vehicle in, it will tell the direction, or um, yeah, the direction in which you locked it in, whether they're coming towards you or pulling away from you. Like for instance, the car coming up behind us. Rear closing. Rear closing and front closing. All right, I was getting the other guy. And that four-wheeler just ran that red light without stopping. You have to come to a complete stop, even if you are turning right on red. So we'll just come up, stop this guy, and just have a chat with him and see what's going on. See if he's got a... Well, we'll see if he has a license. I don't believe you have to have a license to operate. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. have a license to operate one of these on the public roadways. Yeah, so we'll... Huh. One of those nice guys. I apologize. Um, I just want to say right off the bat, I apologize for not uploading the video um, for quite some time. I uh, got stuff going on in my personal life, and aside from that, um, I had a problem with OBS Studio, and it literally has taken me a year to figure it out so I can uh, record to you guys. Uh, so I can record a video for you guys. Sorry. Um, anywho. Um, we have our own CAD system, San Andreas State Police, based off of the Connecticut State Police patch. So here is our CAD, and we're going to check this guy's driver's license. And this is we check the license plates. So, all right, we're going to go here to Odell. All right, at Art. All right, that is an unusual last name for sure, and first name for sure. All right, from Polito Bay. He's far from home. Driver's license is valid, expires in 2022. And yes, um, the driver's licenses, you will come upon some that are expired. So, weapons licenses revoked. Well, he is not carrying to our knowledge a uh, weapon. Now, one thing I do want to point out to you guys, criminal record. So when, you, when we do write, um, people um, 
the citations here on this CAD, they will pop up in here. Same with arrests. So anytime you arrest someone, you do a arrest report or a citation, they will pop up in here. Um, this person has a clear record. Majority of people you run into do have a clear record, but sometimes you do run into repeat offenders, which is pretty cool when you do come across someone that's already been, you know, taken by someone else. So this is the, obviously, you're, you're looking at the police side of everything. We do have civs on here too, um, EMS, and I will show you that here in just a second. I'm gonna let you go. Verbal warning, don't run red lights. I will show you guys real quick. Um, you know what, I'll show you another police vehicle that we have, and we got ourselves the Crown Vic, and these vehicles are all based off of the state of Connecticut, and the state of Connecticut, they do not have markings on their police vehicles. Um, we have, uh, the, our service ambulance, so I'm gonna here a bit so we don't run into that too much beautiful beautiful vehicle and then um okay i think that is just okay i do not have the i, I don't believe this is the fire truck i'm like yes it is okay yeah and here is our one of the fire trucks. Um, I sometimes fill in when we don't have EMS or fire on, I do supplement for them. Hence why I have the vehicle saved and I have um, skin saved for uh, characters as well. So we're going to, we're going to well, we'll sit here one more time, see if we can get anyone actually running that red light. I'll write someone and see if we can get a citation written. If not, we will head out to the 13. Now I also do want to point out to you um, the custom license plates that we have in the, our server here. Um, as you can see right above the radar is our plate reader and Vice City. Um, the 511 WWL is my squad car. The um, San Andreas license plate based off of the state of Connecticut. Alright, so four-wheeler I do think that <laughs> I'm convinced that um, the game 5M is programmed to detect when you're here because vehicles do stuff if you're a civ, but if you're in a police vehicle, nothing happens, I swear. That's what I feel like. I feel like 5M <clears throat> definitely does mess with you if you're role-playing as uh, police, but that's just my thought. And yes, um, I am on a keyboard and mouse. Um, in case anyone's wondering. And there goes a, well, dune buggy. Alright then. Okay, well, is he gonna stop? We're gonna go get him. He did not make that light. That light turned red before he was through the intersection. We're gonna go stop him. I'll settle with that. Okay, perfect. Seatbelt off. <laughs> I always forget about the seatbelt feature. Alright, how you doing, sir? Sergeant Niehaus stopping you for the light violation. You see driver's license, please. Alright, Elijah Maynard. Elijah, I'll be right back. Alright. Nightmare, I guess. Mainer? I, <laughs> I have not heard of that. Elijah. Okay. Let's see what comes up. Los Santos. Alright, so. 47 years old resides in Los Santos and no warrants, driver's license is valid, expires in 2025, and no, it looks like previous record. Well, unfortunately, he had more than enough time just from where we were sitting 
He had more than enough time to stop, so we're going to issue him a citation. We're going to 2205. We're going to go down to signs and signals and failure to obey traffic control device, which is a $260 citation. $260. Submit. Now, when I research him, we'll go back down here, we'll go to the window, we'll click that open, and look at that. On 529, 2021, 2205 hours, he was issued a citation for failure to stop a traffic control device in the amount of $260. So anyone who stops him now, stops who stops this character that pops up, will see that. And same with if I stop someone with that somebody else has dealt with. Same thing. Come up here. Alright. Sir. Uh should we get a citation today? Will you sign the citation for me? Sure thing. Alright. You have a good day, man. Please stop for uh, red lights and uh, drive safe. Perfect. We don't have the animation at this time for issuing the citations, unfortunately. That is the one thing I did like about the uh, previous... Um, I don't know. The previous options that we had... Those have all changed the, to this new um, pack that we have. I'll call it a pack. So, um, I know in the last video that I uploaded, that was 5M, which was well over a year ago, which I still apologize for. It was um, the Florida Department of Public Safety roleplay server. Um, that disbanded, and we are now OSRP. Ocean State Roleplay. We have Discord um, and uh, TeamSpeak. And I'm actually on Discord right now, um, so you might hear in the future, hear somebody uh, hop on and talk to me. I let everybody know that I am on right now. Um, I did not tell them that I was recording, but... I don't think it'll be a big deal if anybody comes on and I tell them I'm recording. I was really hoping um, it didn't work tonight that we could all get together and have a nice uh, time role playing, but it just didn't work out. It's not a big deal, you know. The thing is with our server, life happens. We understand that. We work around with everybody. You know, life does happen, unfortunately. All right, so we're just gonna. Sometimes we get speeders right here. So we'll just kind of back up. And... Uh, that guy definitely looks like he was going fast. Alright, so the speed limit out here, I know it doesn't say up there, is actually 60. 60. 60 miles per hour. We're looking for anybody going 75 or over. You know what? I'm actually going to change the spot that I'm at. I've got the spot that I want to set at. It's going to be right at the tool. It'll be right here. So we're going to face and worry about for right now the northbound lanes. That's going to be our focus for right now. But I'm not opposed to stopping someone in the southbound lanes either. So we'll see what, what pops up. I'm surprised that that guy is not actually going faster. Um, Alright, 74. Okay, maybe I need to. Okay, so I'm getting interference with all the traffic, so I'm gonna jump across and sit right here instead. There we go. 74. Well, radar is not like me today. This is the only bad part. Okay, someone is doing 76, which is gonna be that black car right there on the back. Well, so we just need to find a spot where we can position our radar for the traffic that we're trying to radar for.
And I think I got the easiest way of doing that, sitting just like this. I'm gonna sit like, I'm trying to be a little sneaky. I'm gonna be a little sneaky, but also not sneaky. So we're gonna sit like this, and we're only gonna get now traffic that is going the direction we want. Seventy-two, we're getting closer. Come on. I think it's like seventy-four. Sixty-five, sixty-six. Sixty-seven. So we are the only person on right now. We do not have any sieves at this moment, but that could change potentially in the future. Alright. Huh. Well, it definitely is an uneventful day out here. We'll just have to start moving up more. Usually when you get around the grapeseed area, someone's going 74. When you get around the grapeseed area, there definitely are speeders up there. Yep, we're gonna do that. Like our seven six. Right through a red light too. So we got two offenses now. Speeding and red light violation. Alright. We're going to get him to move over just a little bit by mimicking. There we go. Perfect. The cars don't move over on their own far enough, so that's why we have that feature. So right here, as you can see on the radar 76 and A60, he was at the time passing over. So we'll see what's up with him. And yes, some of these AIs actually will shoot you when you walk up. The name sounds familiar. Um, check the license plate. Dispatch. All right. Insurance and registration. That is a problem in here that is not fixed for some reason. The male, female. So we're not worrying about that for right now. I don't know why it's supposed to link up with this. Anywho, from Polito Bay, uh, valid to 2021. And nothing. So we're going to cite him for two offenses. On May 20th. Twenty-one at twenty-two. Let's see, I'll call it twelve. Close enough. So we got two offenses. We got speeding. One. Okay. Fifteen to twenty over, which is a hundred and twenty-five thousand points. And then we're gonna come up here to figure to stop for a traffic device because he ran that red. So, I just want to make sure to be selected, and it's going to be four hundred and five dollars. Yep, off speeding, and figures 
that crap. Control device. Alright. Alright, so well, I'll let him go with his citations as long as he pays for signs for them. Actually, we, there is an accident or something next to us. We can let him go. Here's your stuff and your things. Let's see what's going on over here. When that icon shows up on the map, that means there's either an accident or something has occurred. It's going to be with this pickup truck. So, what is going on? It's got a flat tire. It wants. It thinks it's on a roadway. It's... <sighs> okay. Well, we're going to call for county tow. And this is how we deal with county tow is arriving on scene. I'm not going to get a tow truck to actually come out there. Um, it will destroy everything. The tow trucks are s not the smartest at all. They're kind of dumb. Kind of stupid. We call the county tow. County tow picked them up. Now we can call for fire and EMS in this also. Uh, fire doesn't necessarily work. I haven't got it to work yet. It's still a work in progress. Um, well, and I was looking at the white car. It came pretty close to me. Um, so that's a work in progress. EMS does work and the coroner does work. You know what? Let's go. I, have, I do have calls enabled, so let's go towards the city. Let's see what we can get. We're gas to while we're headed south. Alright, okay. must have just turned green. Oh, nice. Alright. Alright, this guy, are you serious? We're pacing him about 75-ish. So we're gonna go stop him. Since he wants to speed so bad. Jeez. Alright, so... Oops, not one. We'll go to Mimic. Good enough right there. And yes, you can a vehicle and write a citation on that in real life. Officers do it all the time. I have done that. I went to court on a pace before and had that. Oh, um, small no, no. Yes, there are impaired drivers in this. Stop being for speeding. Let's see. Let's actually. Yes, um. Uh, insurance, do I have to? I don't know, do you? Oh, you know you were speeding? Heavy for the person. Uh, let's ask some questions. Have you been drinking? No, I'm not, I swear. Alright. Oh, we'll go from there. I need to contact dispatch for the license plate check. I always like to call the radio, then try to. Figure out the license plate. Okay, insurance and registration are valid on the vehicle. So we're going to issue her a citation either way, and we will investigate the alcohol injustice. I don't know how to do it. Sal, Sal, Hauser? I'm just butchering this. I'm, I'm going to make myself look like an idiot on YouTube. Alright, from female from Great Seed, at least that's right. 1990. Um, license of valid to 2024, open the window, no criminal records. All right, so we are going to actually measure her site for speed, 15 over. Um, this will be a probable cause in the event she is intoxicated. So, 22... Wait, nah, 22, Speeding. Uh, uh, yeah, you're 
supposed to type this in. Okay, boom. And maybe we'll get ourselves an arrest. And then I can show you guys a state headquarters. Um, let's see, so that's... Well, I'm gonna... Anyways. Because, okay, I'll oh, guess what. Now you're going to jail. Obviously, you can't... 100% get correct with, you know, obviously with the spiel sobriety test and all that stuff. Um, we're in a role play and say we did spiel sobriety. And then she put the other guys here. Alright, so let's go real quick. Uh, plane ticket to Liberty City, huh? Oh, shush it. I don't know what that was about, but okay. So we're gonna call for a tow truck. Come pick her car up. And we'll sit here on the side of the road until said tow truck arrives. And we are not going to... Oh. It's gonna want to send us to Sandy Shores, and we don't want to go to Sandy Shores. We want to go um, down here to the State Patrol, State Police Headquarters. In the meantime, while we wait, we're gonna create an arrest report. And yes, the head of our state police on this server is a real life police officer who does look over these reports. So if you want to join our server but don't want to have to do reports, then I would say join that you can join the fire department or the um, EMS or the SIP. Department. Just don't join the police department because <laughs> you'll be writing reports. And um, Los Angeles is 5,000, Sandy Shores is 5,001, um, Grape Seed is 5,002, Harmony is 3. No, no, Harmony doesn't have one. Middle Base 3. Right? I've not been on here in a long time. One, two, three, four. Nah. Harmony's his own town. No, that's four. Okay, we'll just say one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Uh, that's right, that's how I've always done it. The charges are going to be. Oh. Uh, health and safety, I think. Maybe some exposure. Um, that doesn't look right. Vehicle code. There it is. Driving under the influence of alcohol. Because I am the subject of the patrol police. A glitch. All right, 
down. I don't know what the heck that was about. I apologize for that. That has not happened before. I could not get that siren to turn off. That is definitely a glitch of some sort. I'm just gonna put drink in the alcohol. I don't like the spell. She is stated. Uh, and then conducted. And as I said, we are going to RP that we did. We can't. A field of right at T test in which. On the driver, the AC is showed to zero point zero five. There we go. And normally, you know, you would actually have the option of letting the person go, or we're going to have to stop you. You would normally, in real life, anything under a point one. I know officers can let go and get a ride in some places because, you know, by the time you get to the police department, you need the data master, which we don't do in this server. PBT is not admissible in court, at least here. You know, it is on our server. <laughs> but anyways, so normally you would take them to the police department, the sheriff's office, jail, whatever. Do the data master there, see what the percentage is. Um, if you would, you know, up on a highway and stop somebody for having 0.09, you know, there's a chance that when you get back it's going to be 0.08 or lower, at which point you would have to let them go. But, uh, she was 0.09, BP showed it. We do have a court system in our server here that allows, um, civs, you know, if you get upset, if we, you know, write you a ticket, you know, and you get upset and you're a civ, you can actually go to court. We have a judge, a uh, county attorney, all that. Uh, lawyers, have all that in place. Um, it would be nice to. Oh, there's the speed limit sign. It would be nice to implement that for. Um, since we're the only one on, we're just going to run over the lights. It would be nice to implement that for these SIPs somehow, have a court system. Or not SIPs, for these AIs. Sorry, for these AIs. It would be nice to have a court system for these AIs. But it is what it is. Probably won't ever happen. So as you can see, um, the lights are based off of Connecticut State Police as well. Um, <clears throat> state of Connecticut, they have state police in their um, light bars. Um, I do have, as you see, callouts enabled right now. So call out of a slow vehicle just came in. Um, we'll go check out the state police headquarters first, and we'll see if we can get a call. Take this female in for her drunk driving charge. Should I get that? We don't need that in anymore. We'll take her in on her drunk driving charge and then we will um, see if we can get a call out. Just something good. You know, nothing like slow moving vehicle. We don't want to go to that. We want to go to, we want to, go to something like uh, mugging or shots fired or something. You know, that's what we're looking for. A fun call. All right, here we are. Yes, uh, it does say Los Angeles Police LSPD on the outside. Don't worry about that. Wait till you see the inside. It is the state police headquarters. Yep. And normally, when we actually do get people on, anyone that is a member of the state police, we will actually have a briefing in here with 
whoever the supervisor is. So if I was the sole supervisor on, it would be with me conducting a uh, briefing with everybody else. All right, we're gonna ask her to get out. We're gonna grab her. Um, I'm gonna shut this door. So here we have the parking garage. San Andreas State Police Department. Here, restricted area, authorized employees only. Yep. So we're gonna come over here real quick. And uh we're gonna get her processing mugshot cells lineup. So we're not gonna okay, come on. What is going on with you? Go! There we go. Processing. We're gonna skip all that. We'll leave that for there we go. She's Otherwise, being weird. So we're, we'll leave the processing for um, jail staff. And see you later. She's in custody of the jail staff. Sector A. So we do have cells. Um, obviously, AIs, you know, you put in this or over there. Um, sieves, we can throw in here. And, you know, oh, bummer. Now I gotta sit for, you know, 20 minutes because I murdered someone or whatever. <laughs> whatever it may be. You know, there is a time limit. Um, for uh, purposes of roleplay, we also have the mugshot. I do also, um, on our Discord, I do public um, announcement releases where I say, hey, um, I should have done one with that. should have just done a, a press release. Press release. Um, so we just got some areas over here, we got evidence, our evidence locker, look at all the stuff the state police has been doing. And you will talk to someone to process that. We've got interrogation, observation, rooms, lineup, the works. And back to the cells. Hold on. And then, before I forget. Oh, well, that needs to be uh, changed. There's your lineup room. Oh, okay. yeah, and right here. And this is where. We have victims point out the uh, offenders that committed the crime to them. We'll go upstairs. And yes, we do will play using this entire place. I mean, we could just keep going. Um, we have a major crimes division. Trooper Ryan Massimino is in charge of that. Or is a member of it. I wouldn't say he's necessarily in charge. Break room. You know. Go in there, drink some coffee. This is our officer's cubicles. Receptionist. And uh, here we go. The uh, one room you don't want to get called into. Colonel Massimino. Colonel Massimino. Definitely don't want to get called into the office. And then the top floor, which is just more offices and whatnot. <clears throat> and meeting room. You know. Have our briefings and no wait that is yeah that's one of the rooms where we can do briefings in have our trainings in here yep so this is the state police headquarters for our server pretty nice building 
Alright, let's go out and see if we can get a call out. We'll go back right to, uh, don't worry about that sign. It is not the LSPD. We have the LSPD and the Los Santos County Sheriff's Office in our server. Correction. We do, yeah, no, we do not have the LSPD. No, wait, we do, yeah, we do. <sighs> Can't keep track, it's, I, I've been gone for a little while. Alright, so let's just go downtown and see what we can get to. Side must be green. Alright, let's see what we can get into, huh? I can't force call outs, I wish I could. Or maybe I can, I just don't know that again. <laughs> there's that, I mean, there's a possibility of that. Anything is possible. But anywho, um, let's see what we can get into. Thank you for moving. People do run red lights. Like really, that car right there never even stopped to turn left. Or no, to turn right. It never stopped when it was turning right on red. I apologize, it is late in the evening. Getting a bit tired. <clears throat> hey, you my dude, right? Yeah, I'm your dude. What's up? So, we're just looking for any kind of, you know, fences. You know, like squealing tires. People who go straight through a turn lane, stuff like that. Where do we feel like going today? We're going to just kind of actually turn right right here. Oh, this is a terrible idea. There is a reason I do not come down to the city, and this is that reason. I get so lost easily. Like, <laughs> one of these days, I'm gonna get a video where I'm gonna be in a pursuit, and you're gonna see me so lost, because I don't know any of the city road names, I don't know anything about the city. I get so lost easily. behind us. Should really get up for not having a front plate on his car. If I wanted to be petty. Sorry. Yeah. Alright, anytime now we can get a call out, that would be nice. Box Medical Center. You know what? We're gonna go on the freeway. All right, we're gonna go on the freeway. You know what? We're gonna jump up over here. Actually, troopers normally are on the freeway, so we're going to be on the freeway. I think that's fair enough to say. All right. La 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 la. la. Alright, we can go straight, it looks like. Um, excuse me. I'm literally right here, dude. Like, do you not see me? A parking violation. Sure, why not? I don't know. Oh, shoot. I clicked. I did not need for my lights to come on. That's the only, I would say, bad part. I'm just gonna be at. Oh, that doesn't show me. The only bad part about when you click Y, it activates your lights. So, that guy was going to kind of slow, so. Alright, we can write parking tickets, and I will 
um, show you that. The reason it's turning red on the map, just, um, we're gonna just drive away. We're not gonna deal with it. We're not gonna deal with it. That person has a gun over there. We're just gonna drive away because we're on a call and I don't want to glitch the game out by not responding to the call out. So when you do see the map turn red, something is happening. Um, one of many things will happen. I've learned uh, carjacking, someone shooting at you, someone murdering someone else, someone just randomly walking down the road with a gun in their hands. Anything can happen, I found out. I kid you not, it turned red one time right around, literally right in the center of where I was and someone blasted and killed me. Literally anything can happen with... Oh, great. This is one of... I should have known it was up here. For some reason, the callouts are usually in the same spot. Um, yeah, the callout is going to be in the same spot. It's going to be all the way up here. Sometimes there are is a car park there, other times there's not. All the way up this way. <clears throat> For some reason, all the callouts like to be up here. I don't know if it's a mistake. I don't know. It is what it is, I guess. <laughs> oh, okay, we're coming up to it. It shows it's going to be right around here. We're on scene of a parking violation. And do you see any cars parked anywhere? I do not. Write the vehicle citation, then tow it away. What vehicle? Where? I mean, you're not talking about... There's not a boat down there, is there? The only way that the vehicle around here is if it's in the water. Unless it's like... What? This is what I'm talking about. Sometimes... Okay. Sometimes there's nothing actually there. So... Oh, there literally is no car anywhere. It says that, like there's a car right here. There are no cars anywhere around. Okay, well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do two things. We're going to call it, call out is page four. And then we're going to go in here to call outs. And, uh, oh, wow, it doesn't show up. Okay, well, active shooters. Hell yeah, we're going to go with that. Uh, right here. There are people shooting at me. Okay. her into custody just like that and now I have her gun as evidence okay well, oh my gosh dude get me her cover all right well we are going to now call for an ambulance an air ambulance nope uh, let's try it again this is the only bad part about the the dispatch menu Say is when you're out in the middle of nowhere, <sighs> sometimes it doesn't work. Okay, well, here's the deal you're an idiot. Bambi! Bambi! Oh my gosh, what are the chances of that being her name? Well, guess what? Um, you are now a, a going to jail for a very, very long time. And if she. Yeah, that lady's probably dead. I'm gonna need to do squad car too. Great. And I will do a press release on this one.
this one. Okay, well. Um. Let's try it again. There is here. Only bad part about when you're out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, well. I think she's dead. Let's see if the corner can show up. Nope. Alright, well. Kind of call County Coroner. gonna stay out here. Well, that sucks. Oh, well, there was a way to uh, get rid of pedestrians. Maybe it was P. She's gonna disappear. Whatever. I'm not worried about it. She'll disappear anyways. Bambi. Oh. This. Oh, what an interesting last name. From Great Seed. No weapons license. All right then. Well, oh, right here. Uh, delete. We don't need that ever. Um. Nah, we don't need to even make a report for that. Active shooters. Oh, you all see. Bam. Pampy. I love it. Terrible. Uh, I'm terrible at that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so terrible at that. I did click. I did click. Great rest for you. Okay. Bambi. Say that. Street address 1128 Eastfield Road. I mean, you do have to make it some. To my knowledge. Grape seed. 5,000. I think we said it was 3, something like that. Okay, so we're going to do um, discharge of a firearm in public. Brandishing a firearm. Against the person. Okay. Um, attempted murder. Assault with another weapon. Assault on a law enforcement officer. Yeah. All of those felony charges. So can we do anything else? Um. And we'll leave that up. The main slaughter murder charges up for whoever. House 5, 29, 2021 at approximately 2245, we'll call it. Uh, yeah, we spotted. Wow. Two gun shots upon my arrival. Two 
people. Opening fire. Gun fire upon both of them. I was able to take the defend it into the and it did not have a weapons license on. Actually, there's people branching firearms. And putting the fire up on itself. Perfect. Good enough for me. Alright, well, boom. There we go. Oh, code 4. And we're going to run this individual to State Patrol Headquarters and put her in custody of the jail and get us a new patrol car. And just for the sake of um, showing you guys the Crown Vic, I will drive the Crown Vic. We do have Chargers as well and I believe a Tahoe now possibly or something. Don't quote me on that. We will check that out uh, on a later day. Yeah, okay, so if you do not put the seatbelt on, you can fly out the windshield if you get into an accident and kill yourself. We're gonna run down to the. Since we're the only ones on, we're gonna run down Code 3 and put it in jail. We don't wanna spend the whole video, you know, for an hour doing this. That gets me every time. You know, I'm not used to it. Huh? Huh? What? Uh, move. That's right. That's what I want. And we won't have to do anything more with her. All right, Bambi. You're going to jail for a very, very, very long time. Bye bye. Come back here, and we're just gonna say that maybe this came and got this since I'm literally the only person on here. I can't really have. Oh, this is my character, Sergeant Seedy House. Anywho, um, we handed that off to maintenance, and uh, we're going to now. All right. Well. All right, well, we're gonna um, disregard that 100%. How do I go down? Oh, yeah. <sighs> Oops. Let me do that one more time just to make sure it didn't get anything. And since we were here, we're just going to... No, that's not what I want. No, it's... Oh, yeah, this. this. Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. That's our squad car. Alright. 
kind of is a slow squad, but it's alright. I like it. All the same. Let's get ship the gas. Does gas even show up? Where's the gas station? There was one like right over here, I think. No. Yeah, there's one right right over in this no in this area. Maybe it's right here. Let's go see. I think I just turn this way. I'm trying to think. Where is the gas station at? I guess I don't know where I'm thinking. It's not a no. Where am I thinking? Yeah, there is one right over here, I think. Stick with the crown bag. Heck yeah. I miss crown bags. They look pretty cool. I hear they were not the best squad cars at all. Um, alright then, taco truck. Oh, that's a turn only lane. Burl Boulevard. If I take that, it's gonna take me all the way back out there, I'm sure. I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah, there is one at a gas station in Mirror Park. I'll go to Mill Park. Okay, I can't remember. Um, sheesh. I thought this guy was going to run the light in front of me. I mean, I need to get gas. Just in case. I would have stopped that dude. Let's see if I can finish this video without timing out again. Um, I had been in the middle of recording one earlier, and 5M decided to time out on me. <laughs> Hence why this says ID 2 instead of 1. About time. This is the only thing I hate about role-playing in the city is having to deal with traffic lights. They're annoying as much in this server as they are in real life. I will tell you that. Domestic disputes. Nah. We're gonna get gas. We want something good. Some of these callouts glitch out. Domestic Dispute is one of them. station. Don't want to smack the pole. I don't want to have to explain to the colonel why I destroyed a squad car. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Is this gas station not gonna work now? Alright, sometimes the gas stations don't work with the gas scripts. Or... I should reword that. Sometimes the gas script bugs out. Well, just a second ago it said exit the vehicle. I want to get it. There we go. There we go. 
I said it bugs out sometimes. E to get the spite strip. I would show you that, but I literally don't know how to pick it up, and that spike strip will literally. So, <laughs> it's funny how games work. If I s set the spike strip down, it'll pop every car's tire that goes by, and it will clog up the road. And you know what happens in GTA when you clog up the road, right? Cars crash into each other, explosions happen, total chaos. So, I'm not going to do that as much as I would like to show you the spike strip. I think I have. I am. That's right. I'll show you another character real quick. I am the member of the Highway Patrols um, in the server sw uh, Bomb Squad. So I'll just show you this real quick. Bomb Squad. Active shooters. Let's do it. Alright, we're gonna go back to. Uh, Trooper. Obviously, I'll we'll play throwing that on instead of uh, doing what I just did. Oh, it's going to be back in the same area where we just were, but you know what? Let's just let's go anyway. Shots fired! Heck yeah! I love people with sirens. That's why I do that. And for the purpose of role playing, I will make it semi realistic in a second. As soon as I find where the shooters are at, I will, um. Okay. Ooh, 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 don't want to do that. I will. Oh, uh, no shooters anywhere. Unless they're right around the bend. That'd be just fine by me. Do you see people anywhere? There aren't any shooters. There aren't anybody around. Oh, bummer. I was actually looking forward to, uh... I was going to take my AR out. Alright, well, bummer. Reports, active shooters, delete, no active shooters. And it's still gonna say... Alright, so what if I respond to this one? Oh, oh. Alright, let's do it. I want to, for the purpose of role-playing... If I'm driving the states, one of the states' last crown fix and destroying it at the same time. Yep. We don't want to. We don't want to get ambushed like last time. This shows us not even on the roadway. That's fine. We can work with that. Right up the hill. Just got the AR out. Alright, we got the shooters apparently. Alright, discharging a firearm is an offense. So, we're gonna run up here like we. don't have anything again it happens with these call outs so sometimes there are stuff and sometimes there are not stuff and it looks like we again don't have anything which is not a problem ah bummer at least we were prepared oh boy well 
All right, well, good thing we brought that. We do not want to get eaten by a mountain lion today. I don't even see anyone. There's not even people around. All right, well, we're, we're done. That was fun. Now we get a run back. Another mountain lion. Yeah, we do not want to have to get eaten by one of them because that will kill us. Oh, wow. That will kill us too. Running off a, a cliff like that. We're gonna go straight, actually. Let's not take any more calls for now. I'm not even sure what the speed limit on a dirt road would be. I'm not worried about it though. A lot of traffic out here for a dirt road. Gonna come by you, buddy. Is this like a one way? There's no um, like opposing traffic at all. No oncoming traffic. Whatsoever. Oh, all right. Um, let's do this. Yeah. Ah, duh. I could have just. Well, I didn't know I could just go that way. Well, we're gonna make you turn and head back on the highway. Actually, no, we're not. Yes, we are. We're gonna go right here onto the highway this way. Gonna face uh, northbound. Northbound side is pretty, pretty busy. That's getting towards nightfall, which means impaired drivers. Actually, I'm going to go down the road a little bit. And we're going to face southbound instead. We're going to be looking at the northbound lanes facing southbound. Right here. Closing. All right, welcome back. Sorry about that. Um, I had to relog with 5M. I was having a glitch in the system. It happens every so often. So we were gonna just mess around here for a little bit longer with the ground pick before we call it a night. So um, we're just gonna sit here and see if we can get anything good. Radar into the northbound lanes. They're gonna see what violations we can get of any. Alright, the front radar doesn't like to um, work tonight for some reason. Right there. Right away. 78. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Just catch up to this guy. That red sports car. He's catching up to the vehicle in front of him. He is lying. I uh, went right there. Red light, red light. Oh, right through red. Alright, yeah, we're going to make an assumption right off the. Oh, nope, he's running. We got a pursuit. Alright, 
Ourselves with no assistance whatsoever. And since I'm the supervisor in charge, we're gonna come up towards Polito Bay and then we will, um, we will probably do a pit maneuver and see if we can take him out. And right here to our right is our weight station that we have for our CBE troopers. So we actually role play with using the weight station. Oh boy, just barely missed somebody. Definitely need to take this guy out. I guess I'm taking some screenshots. Let's see if we can do a pit. Alright, so we have three red lights. Oh, that was successful. Alright. Nope. The seatbelt gets me. The seatbelt gets me. Dang it. I had the chance in the seatbelts. I'm not used to having to put the seatbelt on. Not used to that feature yet. Wow. Hey, I was starting to lose them there for a minute. <gasps> Thought I was gonna hit that guy. Alright, this is it. That's it, that's it, that's it. Nope, it's not. Wow. Alright. This person is uh, very difficult to uh, get. Oh, wow. They are getting away. Opposite lanes. They just crashed. We're gonna take them out or not. Well. We are going to be stacking the charges on this person when we get them. going lady other than to jail okay okay perfect all right why in the world is your problem this get over yourself um okay don't know what you mean by that but all right all right we're gonna put you in a squad get over yourself Get over myself, okay? Yeah, totally. Cause I'm, cause yeah, totally. Yep. Cause I'm the one to blame for your decision to run. All right, Miss Marshall, what do we have in the vehicle today? Search. Okay, well, nothing illegal, so... Let me check the license plate. Okay, well... Call a wrecker. We're gonna call a tow... Okay, well, it's going to give us problems again. Are you kidding me? Ah, 
destroyed the front of my squad car. All right, and here's the wrecker. Gonna pick the car up, and we will be dealing with Miss Marshall. J A P W I G A. Jed Big. Alright, whatever this warrant is. So she had a warrant, basically, more or less. Okay, well, guess what? We have. Okay, so. We are going to rack the charges on top of. today. And. G21. Whoops, 21. Not 2023 yet. 23. Fifteen, ten minutes ago. It's an approximate time. One thing I do want to check, though. You got a? You drunk? Nope. I mean, she is intoxicated. It does have a little bit, but is in the legal limits. So speeding. The original reason was seventy-eight. In a sixty. We're going to go fill your. Where's that? Too fast, excessive acceleration, passing. Uh, it's not it. Uh, what else can we get? Operation. Reckless. Oh, absolutely. Um. Oh yeah, right there. Um, intersections yielding failure to yield. She did not stop. Look at all. Um, and I think that's going to be just about it. Okay, so that's just the track. But the rest in here. Um, My city. Five thousand five. We're gonna do vehicle code only a looting. Um, we're gonna do hit and run. Nah, no, not hit and run. We're just gonna hit her with saw on the officer, deadly weapon for hitting me with her car, and that's gonna be it. Type this up real quick. We said it was 
perfect. Upload. Boom. We're gonna take her back to, uh... Look at that. I'm gonna take her back to Polito Bay. And yes, I am running the lights. So we are going to take her, put her in jail, um, and then... We are gonna go off duty at my residence. Before picking up a uh, spare squad. Alright, I don't know why sometimes vehicles drive all stupid like there's a animal. Little Bay. Um, police Department. Alright. We'll take her in custody of the jail staff. Actually, before we do that, we're going to actually do this first. Do a press release. I'll do a, uh, you guys won't, won't see me doing it, Get but, uh, right, lady, right, Get over myself. There we go. Smile for the camera, lady. Boom. I'm in jail. Perfect. Uh, those charges. And, yep, picking up a spare squad right here. And we are 10 8. And actually, gonna go 10 42 here in just a minute. At my residence on Procopio Drive. Fire Department. And my neighbor across the street is one of our um, members who role plays as a, uh, a Blaine County deputy. And he's right across the street from me. So I'm right up here on the right. This has been my house since I joined uh, this community three years ago, I think. This right here in front of me, this house is one of the other members. But yeah, this has always been my residence in all of our servers. Right here. 3019 Procopia Drive. Alright guys, it's been fun. Thanks for tagging along. Definitely had lots of fun today. Let's see, where is it at? Two. Alright, everybody. Have a good weekend. Have a good Memorial Day. Stay safe. Uh, don't drink and drive, please. And um, we'll see you in the next video. Have a good weekend from Gaming with Kirby.